I'll come to this thing later. You are, I tell people that you have to put in one to two hours per day. Is it difficult or hard? One to two hours per day in your business. Your business. Not Dr. Lim's business, not Gigi's business, not my business. Your business. Is it easy or hard? One hour to two hours. Easy? What do you have to do in that one to two hours? Learn? No. Practice? Somewhat. You have to, whatever you have after learning, initially for the new members, yes. Not a senior diamond like Mujahid. When a person wants to do the business, that one hour, he should switch off his mobile and all his iPhone and iPod and I, everything. You have to be with the people and do that to do two hours. What is that two hours? When you talk to people, one person, two person, three person. So the person says, okay, Vishnu, I'm going to try the product. So what do you do? No, you cannot convince. Don't, don't use that word, please. I don't like that word. You cannot convince anybody. You do the first hour. What is that? Retail. The person doesn't want to become a member. He said, okay, Patrick, you can give me the product. I want to try it. So what do you do? You say, okay, this is the place, or you give it to him. You retail. And when you retail, you make PV. And when you make PV, you make money. Remember that. End of the day, money. Mullah. That is what it comes. Number two, when you talk to the person, uh, Sebastian said we have an icebreaker and last two months I have been I have been studying what is ice breaking in MLM business this is just a small touch but ice breaking is the most important part of our business I have written it over here the natural approach is called the ice breakers now, if you learn these two things, I assure you, inshallah, within three to five years, you should be earning 30 to 50,000 dirham per month. I guarantee you. But you have to learn how to talk. Now, if somebody talks to me in Arabic and I don't know Arabic, can I understand her? Yes, no? No. So if you want to talk to me and you want to recruit you in your team, you have to learn my language. What is my language? The language, sister, is how I can get the benefit and what is it, whatever my language is. But the language is basically of natural approach and natural presentation. And this takes six hours for me to teach you. We don't have time because I think some things are happening in the stomach for some people. But what I'll do is I'll try to wrap it in about 10 to 15 minutes. This is where the whole business lies. How do you start talking to the, to the people? Ice breaking. You are in the business. And you don't want to force the person. So what does the person, your friend, Lorna, when, when she says, hi, Lorna, how are you doing? That's what they say after you meet after one week or ten days? Or they say something else? No, 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 don't, don't, don't go follow up and all that. I said, I, I'm your friend. I said, Lorna, how are you doing? This is what I will say or I'll say, when did you dye your hair? I'm not going to say that. No. Of course not, right? I'm, going, I'm not going to say anything like that. I'm going to say, how are you? What, what's up? What are you doing? I want to be close to you. Not going to say something which you are going to slap me. Of course. Right. Because you, you cannot go to a woman and say, okay, uh, that hair, is it real? Or uh, that teeth? Uh, mm, or, or the eye, the contacts? And the wrinkles that you have. 
And what's your age? What's your age? You don't say all that. That's a bad language. What you say is, how are you? Now, if you tell me how are you, and you are my friend, how do I reply? Normally. Fine. Fine. Okay. Alhamdulillah, great, very good. But I am I'm going to add another sentence with that now. I'm going to say, Alhamdulillah, I'm fine, especially after starting my own home business. And what I'm doing is, I'm trying to qualify that person now. Whether that person has listened to what I have said or not. I have been saying this thing from last so many years. I'm fine, I'm great, Alhamdulillah, this, this. But then you have to add this. This is called icebreaker, where you want to qualify whether that the person wants to know about the business or not. If the person says, how's your dog? Which means the person is not interested. So what do you do? You reject that person instead of going after that person. This is what we are doing. We are getting the wrong person in the business. That person doesn't want to do it. You, you, you have not heard, Yaki, I am doing a business. He is not interested. So, this is a complete course. The natural approach. After the person says, what business, then you give little idea and say, tell me more, more, stop. You have built enough curiosity by which the person wants to know more. And he says, look here, sister, I don't have time, I'm busy, you are busy, we are standing in Dubai mall. So, when do you think you want to know more? You have to have, give me one hour. I'm going to tell you more. So you tell me the time and the day and the place at your convenience, not my convenience. Your place, my place or in the food court, day, time. The person says it. Then you go to the next step called the natural presentation. And I've given it so many times and I paid only uh, $4,000 to learn this natural presentation. Only $4,000. So that's the profession we are talking about. When you become an MBA or you become a doctor, how much money do you spend in your education? Dr. Ranjan, how much you spend in Indian rupees? Few lakhs? Till you kept down upgrading yourself? It must be, I think, one crore. That much you spend. So he is a researcher, he is a doctor, he loves it and all that, but still he has to spend money. Now you want to do a business without spending money. Not possible. So if you want to do the business, become professional. There is no shortcut. Alright? So after that you come to follow up, follow through and there is a drip system. And I was talking to these big, big gurus. I said, you talk about the drip system and in UAE and the Gulf, you have got the drip system. I said, what is that? He was trying to tell me all this follow-up thing. I said, I'll give you how we do the drip system in the desert. We have got date tree, small one, big one, and there's a water pipe going and it drips one drop per minute or two minutes and that tree is blossoming. If that water does not go in that day tree or whatever tree is going to survive or die? die? Die. So when you talk to the people who are your prospect or even if they are members or they are leaders, you have to put them in the drip system. What is a drip system? For the person to survive, that water has to be given. And what is the water like? Physically talking, seeing, motivating, appreciating, recognizing those people, number one. Number two, which is somewhat okay, calling. And the, and the worst thing is emailing. That's very not so personal, let me tell you that. A lot of people are wasting their time in that. So that is a drift system, okay? Keep, keep on going and going. In MLM, 
you have to be prepared like soldiers have to be prepared once they go to the battlefield what objection and what rejection that they are going to hear in the market or in the field whether it's uh, your friend your relatives or whosoever they are now this is you are going to hear objections objections are not rejection let me tell you that objections are clarification that they want to know or what they had bad experience only this morning i went to the bank and i took out some money so the guy said uh, uh, where are you working i said my dear friend that money which you are taking out from your teller you don't get in the job i do business so he said yeah i i know this much money you don't get from the job uh i said are you interested to know what business i do now he is counting the money and i am talking in that one minute just one minute you know tell her they have got a number next number is standing in one minute i prospected that guy i said if you are interested you are busy person i am also very busy person if you are interested then call me whenever you are free but i am not going to give you my card you have to give me your number and this is my number because my card is very expensive i know i'm not going to just dish out the cards like anything so if you want to know you call me i know ye there's a big money i said what do you know but he was trying to imply something i said what do you know you please go to youtube and see president bill clinton endorsing my my industry i said do you know president clinton he said yeah, of course everybody knows president clinton i said go to youtube and write president bill clinton and direct selling industry i gave him a hint i said you go and watch that movie it's about 4 5 minutes movie so i'm going to wait and so this is what you have to do objection will be there rejection how will that be when you reject the people what is happening nowadays the prospect is rejecting you right or wrong you talk to the people your prospect is saying no to you now you should be in a position your posture should be so good that you should be saying no to the person not that person saying no to you you will only come to say no to that person if you do the natural presentation professionally all right so i will try to wrap it up about you and I, then i'm going to end up with a very nice uh, dvd that i have is it ready just give me how much do you know about yourself so please write this question everybody has got a, the pad is not for just a take away you should write something how much you know about yourself all right your strength and your weakness one you can write in uh, how much you know about yourself you write in arabic no you know yourself okay one and number two what is your why to do dxn why have you joined dxn not because why reason purpose why why spelling is w h y yeah now this is connected to another word which i have got written is called self realization i cannot do that thing to you is self realization is you have to do analyze yourself evaluate yourself what you want from life what do you want from dxn 